This is from the October 2020 USSAT. College Board is asking us to use the functional notation h of x again. In this case, they give us a linear function and ask for what value of x is that function equal to negative 2. They have answer choices here, so one option is to substitute in the answer choices and see which one gives us negative 2. The other is to set this expression equal to negative 2 and solve for x. I'll try both. I'll start with h of negative 2, choice a, which is negative 4 times negative 2 minus 1 plus 2. So that's negative 4 times negative 3 plus 2 is negative 12, I'm sorry, positive 12 plus 2 equals 14. That is very wrong. So how about we jump to the other end of the spectrum and try h of positive 2, which is negative 4 times positive 2 minus 1, negative 4 times x minus 1, where x is 2, plus 2. So that is negative 4, 2 minus 1 is 1, plus 2, negative 4 plus 2 equals negative 2. And that is what we're looking for. The correct answer is choice D. Alternatively, I can solve this algebraically rather than guess and check. I want h of x, which is negative 4 times x minus 1 plus 2. I want that expression to equal negative 2. So let's subtract 2 from both sides to collect the constant terms that are not multiplied by anything. Leaving negative 4, x minus 1, 2 minus 2 is 0, equals negative 2 minus 2 is negative 4. Divide both sides by negative 4, and I get x minus 1 equals negative 4 over negative 4 is positive 1. I want x by itself, so I'm going to add 1 to both sides because I'm subtracting 1 x, negative 1 plus 1 is 0, equals 1 plus 1 is 2. Same answer I got by substituting in 2. And we often have multiple paths, either an algebra, algebraic approach or substituting in the answer choices. Come back soon for my next SAT video. With math, there's always more.